गुड मॉर्निंग ऑल टुडे वी विल डिस्कस हॉफ ट्रांसफॉर्मेशन एंड लुक एट दिस क्वेश्चन इन दिस क्वेश्चन फोर पॉइंट इट इज गिवेन टू अस फोर कॉमा वन थ्री कॉमा टू टू कॉमा थ्री एंड वन कॉमा फोर एंड वी हैव टू यूज द हॉफ ट्रांसफॉर्मेशन टू ज्वाइन दिस पॉइंट सो इन दिस टाइप ऑफ क्वेश्चन वी विल यूज द स्टैंडर्ड हॉफ ट्रांसफॉर्मेशन इक्वेशन C equals to minus m x one plus y one. Four points which is given to us. It is a four comma one, b three comma two, c two comma three. And D one comma four. Now four point A four comma one in this standard equation. In place of x one, I will substitute four. In place of y one, I will substitute one. So the equation of C it becomes minus four m plus one. Similarly, in this equation, in place of x one, I will substitute three. In place of y one, I will substitute two. So the equation it becomes minus three m plus two. Similarly, four point c two comma three, the equation it becomes minus two m plus three. And for one comma four, the equation of c it becomes minus m plus four. Now look at the next part of the question. In the next part of the question, value of m it varies from minus one point two to zero minus zero point eight. Value of m it varies from minus one point two to minus zero point eight, and the step size it is zero point one. So the permissible values of m are minus zero point eight, minus zero point nine, minus one point zero, minus one point one. And minus one point two. So all these point m equals to minus zero point eight, minus zero point nine, minus one point zero, minus one point one, and minus one point two. We will write. We will write here. M is equals to minus zero point eight. M equals to minus zero point nine. M equals to minus one point zero. M equals to minus one point one, and last. M equals to minus one point two. Okay, so now M equals to minus zero point eight. We will substitute in this equation minus four M plus one. So if I substitute M equals to minus zero point eight in this equation, the value of C we will get it is four point two. Similarly, in this equation, if I substitute minus zero point nine. I will got the number four point six. For minus one point zero, I will got five point zero. For minus one point one, I will got five point four. And for minus one point two, I will got five point eight. Similarly, m equals to minus zero point eight. I will substitute in this equation. So, the value it becomes four point four. If I substitute m equals to minus zero point nine, I will got four point seven. For minus one point zero, I will got five point zero. For minus one point one, I will got five point three. And for minus one point two, I will got five point six. Similarly, in this column, we will also determine for m equals to minus zero point eight, it is four point. Six for minus zero point nine, it is four point eight. For minus one point zero, I will got here five point zero. For minus one point one, I will got five point two. And for minus one point two, I will got five point four. 
नेक्स्ट इन दिस कॉलम इफ आई सब्सिट्यूट एम इक्वल टू माइनस जीरो पॉइंट एट आई विल गॉट फोर पॉइंट एट माइनस जीरो पॉइंट नाइन आई विल गॉट फोर पॉइंट नाइन माइनस वन पॉइंट जीरो आई विल गॉट फाइव पॉइंट जीरो माइनस वन पॉइंट वन आई विल गॉट फाइव पॉइंट वन एंड माइनस वन पॉइंट टू आई विल गॉट फाइव पॉइंट टू After performing this, after performing this table, for each column, I will write what is the minimum value of C and what is the maximum value of C. So here I will write C mean. So first in this column, in this first column, what is the minimum value of C? So the minimum value of C it is four point two. So I will write here four point two. Similarly, in this column, what is the maximum value of C? So I will write here C max. What is the maximum value of C in this first column? It is five point eight. So I will write here five point eight. Similarly, in the second column, what is the C mean? It is four point four. And what is the C max? It is five point six. In the third column, what is the C minimum? It is four point six. And what is the C maximum? It is five point four. Next, in this last column, what is the C minimum? It is four point eight. And what is the C maximum? It is five point two. So after determining, after uh, after doing this tabular calculation, we have determined C minimum and C maximum for all the columns. Now from this result. we have to mark the overall minimum value of c so the overall minimum value of c it is 4.2 this is the least value and overall maximum value of c it is 5.8 so this is the highest value so after doing this calculation so after doing this calculation and after determining the uh, overall c minimum and overall c maximum next you have to do the voting so for voting so for voting we have to prepare a table like this in this side we will vary the value of c so overall minimum value of c it is 4.2 and the highest value it is 5.8 so we will start so we will start from 4.2 in the question step size it is given 0.1 so after 4.2 the next value we will take it is 4.3 next we will write 4.4 4.5 4.6 Four point seven, four point eight, four point nine, five point zero, five point one, five point two, five point three, five point four, five point five, five point six, five point seven, and five point eight. So here we have written. the uh, here we have varied the c from its minimum value 4.2 to its maximum value 5.8 with a step size 0.1 now this side we will mention the value of m so the permissible values of m are minus -0.8 minus -0.9 minus 1.0 minus 1.1 and minus 1.2 so we will write here M equals to minus zero point eight. M equals to minus zero point nine. M equals to minus one point zero. M equals to minus one point one, and M equals to minus one point two. Next, we will target first M equals to minus zero point eight. That is the first row. In first row. 4.2 got one vote. 4.2 got one vote. 
4.4 got one vote, 4.6 got one vote, and 4.8 got one vote. So I will write like this: 4.2 one vote, 4.4 one vote, 4.6 one vote, and 4.8 one vote. Next, we will target m equals to minus zero point nine. In m equals to minus zero point nine, four point six, four point seven, four point eight, and four point nine, all got all got one vote. So four point six one vote, four point seven one vote, four point eight one vote, and four point nine one vote. Next, we will target the next row m equals to minus one point zero. In m equals to minus one point zero, five point zero got four vote. So m equals to minus one point zero and five point zero got four vote. Next, we will target m equals to minus one point one. M equals to minus one point one. It got one vote for five point four. One vote for five point three. One vote for five point two and one vote for five point one. So m equals to minus one point one, five point four vote one vote, five point three got one vote, five point two got one vote, and five point one got one vote. In the last, we will target the last row. M equals to minus one point two. M equals to minus one point two. In this row, five point eight got one vote, five point six got one vote, five point four got one vote, and five point two got one vote. So five point eight, one vote. Five point six got one vote. Five point four got one vote, and five point two got one vote. Now after voting, we will target the maximum vote. So in this voting process, in this voting table, the maximum vote it is four. And for this four, what is the value of C? The value of C it is. The value of C it is five point zero. What is the value of M? Value of m it is minus one point zero, and remember the our standard equation c equals to minus m x plus y, the standard equation of Hopf transformation. So in this standard equation, in place of c I will substitute five point zero, in place of m I will substitute minus one point zero. So if I do the substitution, the equation becomes 5.0 is equals to x plus y, or y equals to minus x, or y equals to minus x plus 5. This is the equation of line to join the given four points. So finally, so finally, my equation of line it is y equals to minus x plus five. So this is the equation of line. This is the equation of line to join the given four points: four comma one, three comma two, two comma three, and four one comma four. Thank you.